Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome to year eight of our settlement in Ostriv. I cannot believe we're on year eight. This series has been going for eight weeks, and I haven't absolutely annihilated everything. We've come close once. We've really come close once. I think it was back in year six. We absolutely annihilated our economy and, quite frankly, we're still recovering from it a year later. Our main focus this year will be creating, uh, building up these houses and getting more people in because we need the workforce and getting through these last few buildings so that we can actually have some clothes coming into our, into our community because clothes are the bane of my survival at the moment. It is what is absolutely destroying me at the moment. That's going to be a tall order. Cowhides, lime, salt, bark, and water. Holy crap. Let's just go for one <laughs> batch at the moment, shall we? <laughs> Let's just see how we can cope with doing that. <sighs> wow. We can't even... <laughs> can't even make it a bigger batch because we don't have any cows to slaughter <laughs> oh no <laughs> right i know i said i'd wait till like three years but we have more than enough i might actually slaughter them once they get to a year maybe that's a yeah yeah i think i'm probably gonna do that and actually saying that logistics wise I don't think we need workers on these I think they can actually survive just with laborers because the laborers are topping everything up yeah I don't think we need workers on them huh well that's definitely something different uh, I'm only going to hire women on that, actually. See, it's, it's, it, this is a weird thing about this game, is that in some regards, it's actually better to block men from jobs. <laughs> right, what are you selling that I can uh, be useful? This also confuses me. What do we actually need? for the salt works because i have never done a salt works before oh my god we need horses or oxen oh holy crap okay that's a thing are you selling horses then are, are they expensive oh god they are expensive when we need a stable Oh no. <laughs> and we can't even drag that over because it's bugged. I legitly think this is bugged. Oh no. <laughs> We've run out of wood again. At least it's not firewood. At least we haven't run out of firewood. We're quite close to it though. Oh dear. <laughs> right. Work. Make the wood. <laughs> right. Are we out of thawing season now? Can we start getting our fishing going again? See, this is, we just have, we have too many jobs. It's all right, it'll go, it'll go in, in uh, March. We just have, we have too many jobs. Fully mill, wonderful, which we cannot use because we, oh no, we can use, oh nice, we can't use because we haven't created <laughs> wool yet, oh god, <laughs> oh this is, <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
You know, it's a good thing I have never ever claimed that I'm actually good at this game. Yeah, see, they're not plowing it. How the hell do we solve that? And we don't have any leather because we're still trying to produce it. We haven't made any lime yet because that's still creating. So you can go and do something else. Might as well have an assistant because I oh know we'll just use laborers for that. Huh. Yeah, we are we are starting to have a few issues here. Um Wow. That's expensive. 20? Bloody hell. I suppose it is quite difficult to make. To be fair, it is quite difficult to make. We're just going to have to go with it. No, I don't want 10. <laughs> right, we're going to have to build a stable somewhere. I really don't want to build it there. Oh, I can build it here. Lovely. Lovely. Right. Whack that through. We're making wood, so that's fine. I'm not still producing that, are we? Right. Anyone looking for jobs? 19 women looking for jobs. Oh. Crap. Oh, yay. We're making wool. Nice. Only hire women. <laughs> there is literally a reason a bunch like a bunch of times to only hire women. Legitimately a reason. <laughs> right, you can go over there. You can not do anything because we're waiting for the horses to arrive. Balls, 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 balls. That's not good. Houston, we may have a slight issue here. I think we might have slightly shafted ourselves. Oh, nice! We've made broadcloth! Huh! Uh, what did we actually need that for? <laughs> it's going so well. Uh, that's what we need it for. The tailor's workshop, which we haven't even built yet. Perfect. And even if we had built it, we couldn't use it. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Where's all the wood going to? I mean, I get our building stuff, but jeez. There we go. Inefficiency is in the weirdest places. Okay, so all resources are collected, it's fine. Then. You know, build. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to. Actually, 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 you're fine because by the time you get here, we're gonna have a stable. So that's fine. I do need, however, I don't need more sheep because we're making. Yeah, we're making it a fine pace. We're doing fine. Actually, can I... Um, how much? Still have 1,200 sunflower oil. Is there anything else we can sell? <laughs> Do you want to buy metric ass tons of bark from me? 
because I'm, I'm way, 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 way overproduced it <laughs> by like mammoth amounts. Ah, that's really annoying that 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 plow's bugged. I don't know. I bear with me. I'm gonna go and Google this because I there must be a way to get this thing to move. If other people have had the same issue with it, I want to know if they've managed to solve it. So, I eventually figured out why the plow wasn't moving. Because they needed to finish threshing all of the wheat they had over here before they would move the plow over. So, that's an interesting thing. Uh, right, why are... <laughs> so many people moving yeah, out do we not have we probably don't have something do we oh no we have the same issue as before our oh, balls <laughs> balls 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 okay pause everything there was something that had a lot of firewood on that i was looking at before something was storing a lot of firewood and I can't remember what it was it was that the salt works is what trashed my firewood you son of a bitch <laughs> right if, if we put that down to 500 will people take it it's fine we can survive we can survive we can survive it's fine we can we can recuperate <laughs> oh god it's just gonna be an entire year of us just saving ourselves oh my god we're literally using firewood <laughs> we're selling firewood as fast as we're creating it this is insane well we've got enough buckwheat and fish to survive us for our lifetime so it doesn't really matter that we don't have potatoes and stuff oh dear right also i've realized why you need to have workers on these ones so that they can collect the eggs and the chickens and the stuff right you've reached a year bye bye yes we have another bull perfect um i'm supposed to be making horseshoes but <sighs> oh god everything's going to crap <laughs> um why is it the one time i actually need something is not here buy firewood <laughs> oh dear also why are you not fishing be fishing there's more than enough for you to be doing it right we have recuperated the situation and now I'm just gonna leave you making that and we will get back to constructing our houses. I'm actually gonna put everything that needs. It's not. It's not too bad. I was gonna move every single one that needed a, a lot of trees to the end, but it's actually not that bad. Right. You will need, however, a market stall over here, and you're gonna need. Um, Eggs, chicken meat, pork, and sallow, and then you'll need buckwheat, uh, fish, firewood, <laughs> most definitely. <laughs> um, 
sunflower oil, uh, potatoes, and go. Oh, you need flour. Um, I'm just going to do another thing of firewood. And... We have, do we have potatoes in here? No, we don't have potatoes. So... Potatoes. Wonderful. Right. We might as well put workers on these because they're not doing any other jobs in there. <laughs> and we are back up to nearly 140. I don't actually know what the highest population we've been up to so far is. Storage is full. Quite frankly, I do not give a toss. <laughs> we are going to continue making everything we possibly can. Right, what did I need for these guys? Four horseshoes and one tack. Well, we're making more shoes. And I think you actually need. Yeah. I thought you did. You need an actual building to make tank. It's kind of frustrating. Because I, I guess I'm still, like, quite early game, so there's a lot of items that we just have no need for at the moment. Uh, we might as well put that up there because that's nearly done. Oh, that's going to be another job, isn't it? Yeah. Let's get on with making some thatch. And once again, <laughs> we have more jobs than we have people. Wonderful. Right. How's our stock of fish going? <laughs> Is it still massively high? Where's fish? Yep. 4,000. Wonderful. Can't go wrong with that. And 26k of firewood. Again, can't go wrong with that. So, we still need salt and lime. Reducing quick lime. Then we do have... We do have a lime works, don't we? We built a lime works. I'm sure we did. I wouldn't have been that stupid, would I? Huh. I was that stupid. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yep, no, we need a... Uh, in that case, we need a lime box. Fair enough. Uh, what can you be useful with? Absolutely soddle. <laughs> and the cops will get Emma. God damn it. It's going to be easy just to get ox at this point. <laughs> oh, we have more year old, year old, year old. Sorry, peeps. But we need your meat. Actually, we probably don't. <laughs> yeah, let's just, let, let's, let's, let's chill out on that for a while. Plus, we could almost do and make another granary. Uh, is there anything I can put in here that's going to help you? Not really. Choosing a hard mm. I feel like they're going to die before they reproduce. <laughs> Chickens are going really well. Alright, we can't use that. We need line for that, so that's being built, that's being cooked slowly, very slowly, um, that's the reason why we can't burn it on that, right, that's fine, we'll go halfway of that, increase the limestone we're getting from that so that we can put it into the lime kiln. Lime works even though we're building them, we can't actually use them. <sighs> oh god. It's fine, everything's fine. We're doing absolutely fine. 
next time any of these comes up with bloody sheep, I am buying them. <laughs> ah, are you selling salt? No, you're not. I've just figured something out. We can't make salt without draft animals, and we can't make draft animals without leather, and we can't make leather without salt. Ah. So either we need to buy leather, which is going to be expensive as hell, or we need to buy salt. Okay, that's a thing. Annoyingly, I don't think we can... Yeah. That's quite frustrating. Wow. That requires a hell of a lot of locking. <sighs> Holy crap. <laughs> We're never ever going to need any more lime ever after we've done this. So, ladies and gents, it is January and the question is, what have we actually done? <laughs> so, we have a various amount of things in progress. Um, I have decided to go the slightly longer route of uh, achieving leather and everything like that. So we actually have gotten quite close to uh, the lime kiln being complete and uh, ready to cook the first batch. And from that, uh, we will then be able to create some leather. I think I might have to buy some salt. I think I may have to buy some salt. I'm also, if we get a chance, I'm going to buy some lime. However, because of the amount of money we spent on animals, and buying the horses was, buying the horses was a mistake. That was a big mistake. I, we're way too early aim for horses. That was a big, big mistake. Um, and it's put us quite heavily in debt. I'm not gonna lie. We uh, <laughs> we have <laughs> spent a lot more than we were getting in. A lot, lot more. Um, now, a few people were having a little bit of trouble with money, so I have turned down um, a few taxes, just by about ten or twenty coins. Um, not a major amount, but. Just enough so that I think over time it will uh, it will do the job perfectly. So, in year nine, believe it or not, we're going to finish building all of our houses. Hopefully we'll have the lime kiln uh, will be rocking and rolling. We can buy some salt to get our first batch of leather through. And uh, yeah, I, I might buy two bulls because I don't I I can't imagine you would need the horseshoes and the tack for the bulls to be able to use them in the salt works that's that's my that's my thinking at the moment is I can understand why the horses would need horseshoes and the and the reins and tack and everything like that but I can't imagine that the bulls would so if we get the option to buy two new bulls then we are definitely going to buy two new bulls also, if we get the option to buy some more sheep, <laughs> I'm definitely going to be doing that. So, yeah, that is the expansion currently going. I am sure we're going to expand all kinds of stuff out into here. I um, feel like I'm basically going to use this as an excuse to lay this area out properly so that we can then demolish the mess that we've made up here because this is apocalyptic design absolutely apocalyptic i might have to actually watch some videos on kind of efficient designs for ostriv because i know what efficiency is in things like city skylines and stuff like that um but ostriv i i do not know what the efficiency is for uh for community layout so i'll have to watch some videos on that as always ladies and gents thank you very much for watching thank you very much for your support and i'll see you in year number nine.